This video is thanks to this guy Mirage, uh, at Beyond Desires. He has a YouTube, so go to subscribe to him. So stuns are being removed. As you can imagine, this cooks stun builds, as without stuns, the meta for magic is transformed. Snow mages, wind mages, ice mages, lightning, explosion mages typically define themselves with a stun. The most damaged by this is wind and snow, since their whole gimmick is the stun. Coupled with snow's speed nerf, it's a bit of a gutting. Now, stuns have been replaced with a 1 second slow of 50%, which if you think of slow 5 gels in 1.13, it's 1 second of that. So I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's rendered useless. Unless you have some big-ass spells, it wouldn't be much different to their normal movement. So what matters will this bring in for magic? For mages, I think we can all agree that Shadow, Light, and Glass, Glass because of their new Arcanium modifier affinities, will kind of dominate. Like, stat efficiency will be so much more important, with no stun gimmicks to carry a magic. Conjurer is kind of similar, as Shadow becomes a superior Snow Conjurer, but Light and Lightning will be much more similar now, with Lightning getting a damage buff to counteract the loss of a stun. Wind Conj will just stay ass, unless they put its MV damage up to 0.9. Ash Conj becomes a tragedy, since it has a full second stun before, and now it's just kind of stuck as a mediocre class with nothing that stands out too much. Being like a less extreme dense on imbue, with the minus 0.1 to Conjurer's imbue infinity size. Affinity size, the fuck? I think Light, Lightning, and Shadow will be the meta Conjurers. Obviously Warlock will be much more complex since there's 120 combinations for it. But I think a lot of stun Warlocks are just OP regardless of the stun. Thermo's been hit pretty hard by the balance dock, so if the nerfs go through in their entirety, Thermo might just be cooked. But for viable builds, we're left with Iron Leg, Sailors, and Basic. Since Boxing also got a speed nerf, which is also coupled with the overall attack speed nerfs, it's probably just gonna suck. So for Iron Leg, I believe Ice and Acid will be unfair good. Because Ice is getting a damage buff and a bleed synergy buff, it'll just shred through HP and have huge AoE. Acid also stacks DOT with a synergy, decreasing size to accomplish this. Very, very strong. On Sailors, Ice and Snow are still OP, just less than they were, like in 1.14, 13, 12, you know. Um, Lightning too, but I believe Lightning is better with it now since Paralyze is pretty unpredictable in what it does, so the new uh, stunts will actually benefit Lightning in my opinion. For Basic though, the obvious choice of Shadow is good, but not the best. I believe Glass is actually the best choice for Basic, as it couples Basic strong stats with your DOT with no size, damage or speed loss. That's not even mentioning the Arcanium affinities with which Glass is just so overpowered. Any magic with strong stats works on Basic really though, so you should be all good. And for all the Paladins out there, the best magic is the magic of brewing an interchange potion. Hope this video helps you build builds in Nimbus. Consider subscribing if you appreciated it.